Hello Udo users and welcome to our channel. Today we will show you the demo of DHL Parcel Shipping Integration. DHL Post and Parcel Shipping Integration is based out of in Germany, Netherlands and Switzerland. In this video, I will walk you through the company and shipping level configuration step by step. This module operates in test and production environment as well. Key features covered in this video are multi-pack creation, multi-label generation, live shipment tracking, cancelling of shipment directly from the Udo without navigating to the shipping company's dashboard. So let's explore it. First of all, we will download this application from the Udo App Store. So this is the Udo App Store. From here, we will download this application or see install this application. On installing, first we will configure our company settings. So let's go to settings, open user and companies and go to companies. As we go to companies, we have created the demo database. So we'll open the company. Uh, here we'll mention all of our company details and after that we will go to DHL DE configuration here as we go you can check this box and you will mention all this information that is user id password and api keys it will be provided to you by your shipping provider that is DHL parcel DE so as we mention all this information we will go and configure our shipping configuration so currently this is the demo database so i'm not mentioning any information over here so let's go to our sales module to configure shipping configuration here we will go to configuration open shipping methods and here we'll see we have the shipping service configured so let's go here we'll mention the shipping method name here we will mention the provider or say select the provider from the drop down and here are the configurations so first is the company configuration if you have more than one company in your Udo database you can select any one of them to which the DHL parcel will be applicable next is the package information here the default package will be selected so there are different types of packages that you can configure that can be of a box or envelope or anything that you wish and in the internal link you can also mention the size of boxes career code and career name as well from the drop down you can mention the weight of the boxes as well after the same, you can get uh, another configuration that is uh, weight and you can mention the weight in kgs and grams. So we have configured the same. Next, next is the product name. So there are shipping service which are accepted by DHL. We, and we have configured them all over here in the drop down. You can select any one of them. Next is the DHL account number. So the users might be provided with the account number by DHL and you will mention that over here. It will be more not more than 10 digits so this is the demo one currently next is the dhl procedure number so this will be a two digit number which we have configured over here and it will be provided to you by dhl for the shipping purpose next is dhl participation number it can be referred as the part partner id and it can be numeric or of alphanumeric disease so here we have mentioned the same and after configuring all these details we will go to creating a sales sort so let's create one sales order uh, let's add the customer add the product and add some multiple quantities as we add the quantities we will add the shipping from over here so let's add our shipping method that is the hl the weight is automatically fetched and we will add it on adding the same we will confirm our sales order so now as we confirm our sales order we will go to delivery order in the delivery order, we'll go to additional information where I can see that the career information can be even uh, changed from here. Or in case if you have not selected the shipping method in your sales order, you can select in the delivery order as well. So here, if in case if by coming in the delivery order, you want to change it, you can change it from here. Next is the weight that is automatically fetched and the tracking reference will be fetched over here as we validate the delivery order. Before that, we'll go to operations. And I want to divide this quantity into two packages. So let's create multiple packages. So let's go over here. In first packages, I want five pack, five quantity. Save it. Go to put in pack. Select the package type and save it. Next is the remaining quantity. So let's again uh, repeat the process. Add a line. Take the stock from warehouse. Save it. Put in pack again. Add the packages and save it. And after this, you can see that the packages smart option will be seen over here. As you open it, you can see that the packages are created over here. So let's go back and now validate our shipment. So now we will validate it. On validating the shipment, tracking reference will be fetched over here. 
and the labels are generated. So as you can see, there are two labels generated for the two parcels or say two packages. And this label will be fetched by DHL itself. So this is configured as per their requests and you can see all the information. This is the second label. And now you can see that the tracking reference is fetched. You can also have a tracking smart button over here where you can lively, lively track your shipments. Uh, yeah, you can enter the shipment number and search it. As this is the demo version, you will not be able to track the same. So let's go back and here we have option of cancellation as well. You can cancel the shipment directly from here in case if you want to. So as you cancel the shipment, as you confirm it, you will get the shipping log created over here. So as you can see that the same is done. So this is all about DHL parcel day shipping integration. And if you face any issues by configuring the same, you can reach out to us. Our team will be there to help you out. Feel free to let us know. Uh, so don't forget to save, subscribe and share our videos to the Udo users and help them. Thank you.